How do we proceed in the polarity analysis? I do not do such a complex psychological exploration as, for example, Massimo, Massimo Mandelavori um, showed today. I'm really seeking solid facts. I will show you what I mean with this term. The most solid symptoms are the polar symptoms, especially polar modalities. We developed a questionnaire for ADHD children and questionnaires concerning the other symptoms. And within the ADHD questionnaire, we ask for these symptoms. Does he have problems with reading? Does he have an aggravation from reading? Does he become impatient or irritable? Is a child very uh, awkward when it's, it's writing? Does it cramp up a lot? This would have to do with visual uh, disturbances or tactile disturbances. There are children who become nauseous when they drive in a car shows that you have a problem of balance, then is a child overly sensitive to cold and has a strong desire for warmth. This would give uh, thermal, thermal symptoms of, and then as a result, um, this child has a very strong sadness. Actually, it's depressive. Um, so these are Eric's polar symptoms. What we have here is very, very little. Would we be able to find a remedy with these few symptoms we have here? Actually, no. The only peculiarity are his tics.